<laughs> Ready to go, Abby? Mm -hmm. Ready to go, Lewis? Yeah. Brooke? Nah. Uh. Here you go. You ready to go? Take a selfie. <laughs> everyone from a very scenic Loch Tummel. Where? We are at Loch Tummel. We are at the Queen's Point. Queen's View. Queen's View. Just now we are on our way up to Landmark which is a forest adventure park uh, near Abbey Moor. <laughs> oh don't throw them over the edge. Here you go. So there's Abby and Lewis and Hugo and Willa. And Jack, there's Brooke and Molly. We're on our way to the adventure park. Um, it's dog friendly, so we thought it'd be an ideal place for a family day out. That little puppy is still too young to walk. He's not had his second jag yet, and uh, he really doesn't want to be carried. <laughs> he wants down beside all the rest of the puppies. It's a shame. It will be fun in the adventure park. He's going to be wriggling the whole way around. So isn't it just gorgeous up here? We're taking advantage of the nice weather because it's supposed to rain all day. But we don't care. It won't spoil our fun. Yeah, I thought we'd just come on and introduce the vlog just now. And uh, let's see what we get up to at Landmark. <laughs> I'm not posing, Boy. Abby. Boy. <laughs> The things we do for football. And there's a Bernese over there as well. Jack took Hugo to meet the best of Bernard. Oh, he's wanting to play. Sure. Look at him. Oh. And there's a Costa there, but we're only 10 minutes away from the park, so we're not getting a coffee. You go. and there's some flashing images coming up.
just like Christmas? Oh. Do you like Christmas, Lewis? Yeah. How much do you love Christmas? A lot. What the Good. Heck? Oh, that's cool. <laughs> <laughs> Look at my wheels! <laughs> yes! You've got a big bum at last, Abby! So, the kids are going on the treetop trail thing, the Tarzan Trail. Jack is away to try and get a coffee. I'm sitting here with Hugo and Molly. Look at them. Look at the squirrel. Mind me nuts. <laughs> Love it. It's really clever. They've got a lot of good details. Very impressed. I still love the bums. <laughs> so we came down the hill to the little outside seating bit. Jack's over there. He's been stopped uh, to talk. To, somebody wants to talk to the puppy. And it's lovely here. There's so much everywhere you look. There's different things to do. The kids are desperate to do that. The rafts that you go down the big hill and get soaked. So I think they might do that last, <laughs> unless it rains and we get soaked anyway. So yes, it's definitely, uh, there's a big climbing wall. It's great. And there's lots of dogs, which we love. I just realised I've not spoken to you properly yet today, um, and not really said where we are. So we decided we wanted to go for a family day out and we wanted to include Lewis, Abby's boyfriend. So we decided to come up here. Now I saw Landmark on the Sullivan family's vlog. They were talking about it. So I looked into it and thought, oh, it looks good. And then when we found out it was dog friendly, we were like, definitely. The whole family can go great. So it's fantastic. I got a, I got a disabled discount. Jack got in free as my carer. So for me, Jack, Abby, Lewis and Brooke, it was about £86, which is really good for the day. Um, and yeah, so they're all away, they're just going, having fun, doing whatever they're doing, and we're just about to get something to eat. Oh, here he comes. <laughs> be fair which is good but um she wasn't very keen on a lot of the the treetop walky things were you no. she came back to see molly you still Mom. shaking Mom. oh look at hugo like <laughs> yeah you don't like heights or bridges yeah, and that's one. both <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Sit and have an ice cream while the kiddies are going on the roller coaster. Here they come. The big tower. It's a very tall tower. Going in the butterfly house. What if the world had more of your smile? What if the wind could spread your love? What if your sweetness could reach everyone? Be no wars. Mm. Maybe the birds will sing about your heart. Maybe the trees will whisper the word. Maybe the sun will spread your joy to the ones who lost their hope. Yeah, yeah, dream 
so the kiddlies are going on the water right now, the rafts. We don't know which one they're doing. We shall see. Abby reckons she wants to do all three, but I don't know if she'll be brave enough to do the steepest one. <laughs> You've got a picnic area down there, if you bring your own picnic. There's a digging station, there's a labyrinth there, a maze. There really is loads to do here, isn't there? Brilliant. It's well worth the entrance fee. I mean, they've done a lot more today than they ever would at Alton Towers. Because Alton Towers, you spend more time queuing than you do anything else. Oh, Was that good? Yeah. We're going on the next one now. What one are you going on? The middle one, the bumpy one. Oh my god. The staff up there are just rotating to whoever's free. Of course we got the one that had to take me down the tree zone. Oh no! <laughs> Oh! <laughs> Have fun! Do you not want to wait for Brooke and go on together? Oh, is it too? Right. Let's see you. Wow! Can I go on another one? Yeah, go for it. <laughs> what was that one like? <laughs> the, the, the drop. Lois was like, come on, that line's shorter, you can do it. You're not pushing it out this time. I was like, <laughs> that was panicking up the top and it was actually fun. Was it fun? Yeah. Did you enjoy it? Yeah. And the line's quite yeah. small for that one as well. Oh, good. That's the one Brooke's going on apparently. That so. was really fun. Good. Did you get wet? No. Oh. I got wet on the swirly one. Right. Oh my cool. God. <laughs> Are you doing the other one? The line's quite long for that. So if we're, if we're going again, we are doing the vertical again. It's up to you. Brooks will be there anyway. Oh, look. Clyde just loves Lewis. Look at them. Oh. Do you want to do it one more time? Or? The big one. Yeah. Go so with me if maybe for one more time. I would have a turn with these. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> We've done pretty well. We got to about three o'clock before the rain started. <laughs> Just waiting for Britt to do the skydive. Jack and Abby and Lewis have taken the puppies back to the van. And once Britt's done this, I'm going to head back to the van too. And that'll be us heading off. <laughs> us arrived at McDonald's in Perth. Um, we've still got a couple of hours to go until we're home. It's about three and a half, four hours away, the park that we were at, but it is an amazing day out. That's the first time we've been and we will definitely be back. It's well worth the long journey. So it's Landmark Forest Adventure Park. Here you go! 
Then I went to McDonald's and he's left. Oh, Hugo. Um, yeah, well worth it. If you've got any kids of any age, all ages are catered for. Most of it's wheelchair friendly. All disabilities are catered for. That's, they were just... The staff were amazing, really friendly. It was very clean. They were constantly going around picking litter up and it was very clean. Just an excellent, excellent day out. So, such good value for money. The food was a wee bit expensive, but it always is at places like that. They had a restaurant you could sit in at. They had a takeaway burger place, a takeaway ice cream and donut place and... That was pretty much it for food and drink, but they did also have a picnic area where you could take your own, so you don't even need to spend money on food and drink. And I think if we go back, we will be more prepared. We'll take a big um, a rucksack with a picnic and extra water for the dogs and stuff, because we did have that, but it was in the van. Um, but yeah, it was just a really fantastic day out. The kids loved it. I mean, Abby and Lewis are 16, Abby's nearly 17, Brooke's 12, they loved it equally. Um, I was able to get into a few of the places. I got into the butterfly bit and the bamboozoleum bit. I got round the dinosaurs. Just loads of stuff, really. And the fact that it's dog friendly is amazing. All the people were friendly as well, not just the staff, the actual visitors. There was loads of them coming up talking to Hugo and they were all so polite and just lovely. The whole atmosphere was just brilliant. Really cannot recommend that place enough. Anyway, I think I'm going to sign off for the vlog now. That's us, like I said, just about to get a McDonald's. The puppies are getting their burgers too. And um, like I said, it's going to be probably about half seven, eight o'clock by the time we get home. So I'm going to say goodbye now. I hope you've enjoyed this. If so, please hit the thumbs up button. Have you been to Landmark before? Let me know in the comments below or do you fancy going? If you're in Scotland at all, it's well worth it, I have to say. Even if you're in the north of England, it's definitely, definitely worth it. Really good. Anyway, I'm going to head off now. Please subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you in our next video. Okay, bye! Thanks everyone, bye!